Sure, I have influences. Um, some of them I can't really talk about because I get a little emotional, but um, I will tell you that T-Bone Walker was probably the main reason I got into music, he and Jonathan Winters. Um, and Jonathan didn't do a lot of records. We did some records, comedy records mostly, but there was a rhythm that this guy had that I use in all my stuff. It's a, uh, if anybody really comes through in my records, I think it would be Jonathan Winters in terms of the, the, the rhythms, you know. Um, it's, it's kind of a, a syncopated thing. You know, everything I do is, it's got a lot of what they call syncopation, it's a music business term that we use uh, for things that are kind of off. I think my music is a little off, if you know what I'm saying.
You know what? Madonna is my sister-in-law first, and a great singer, poet, songwriter second. And um, well, I'll put it this way: I didn't use her. Okay, I, I did. I did not use Madonna to further my career. I mean, I thought about it. Believe me. I mean, there were times when I was uh, eating at Ben Frank's and you know, barely able to tip the waitress when I thought, golly, Madonna's just sitting over there in that big old house and here I am eating beans and weenies at Ben Frank's. Um, so yeah, there were times when I thought about using her. Um, okay, I asked her once and she turned me down. Uh, my wife um, wouldn't want me to talk about this. Sorry. You know, when I say I haven't sold out, I guess that's not exactly accurate. I mean, trampoline uh, kind of crossed over into the pop market, uh, and uh, it wasn't intentional. It's just I was feeling light when I made that record, uh, hence the name Trampoline. I, I just uh, I felt uh, that, um, you know, here I'd been doing all these dark, brooding records and everything, and, and uh, I think when I went into the studio, I just had a... Um, well, it was kind of a new day for me, you know. I, I had, uh, had a baby on the way, uh, and uh, I just I didn't feel like talking about anything bad. And I think on this record, I've gone back to my uh, to my soul, which is dark and horrible and twisted. Uh, you know, trampoline really. You know, people love trampoline, and I I, I got to say I was disappointed in it. This record has brought it all back. Um, because if I can't, uh, you see that? It's like a ghost. The leaves and wind start, it's amazing. I bring up this record and there are a lot of ghosts in this record, I gotta say. Um, trampoline was, was easy to make, you know, but that's not what I'm in this for. You know, I, I, I'm not in this, uh, in this music business, if you wanna call it a business. Uh, to make things easy on myself. I do this as, uh, well, it's a, it may sound trite, but it's my therapy. And, uh, and this record has really, really cost me a lot of money. And some of my soul. I need to take a break for a second. Yeah.
Where I get political is when you start talking about uh, insurance. Uh, I, I'm, I'm really against insurance. They, they charge you an arm and a leg for insurance. Now, I, I'm not insuring this new record. No insurance. I, the, the premiums are so high, I, uh, don't get me started about politics. I have an obsessed fan who cooks for me. Uh, she uh, thinks that, uh, you know, since I am from Hawaii, that I need some good old home cooking from there. She, she brings my lunch every day at noon. Uh, she's never threatened me. As a matter of fact, from now on, I'm only starting this on this record. It's funny you mentioned that. Uh, I'm actually going to start putting my address on, on my records. I don't like movies, never have. Uh, I think, uh, as a matter of fact, I don't even think they should have music in movies. It gets in the way. Hate it. Mr. Henry, thank you for your time. You're welcome. You guys told me that this was going to be like a fun thing. This is really depressing. <laughs> <laughs>